I can't lie to you guys. I'm a selfish son of a bitch. <laughs> but yes, I am having an open lobby for Need for Speed Most Wanted. It's gonna be this Saturday. And I figured, quick little video, we'll get some more people to join this motherfucker. Because the main reason why I'm doing this is that I need to finish the platinum trophy for this bitch. Now, here's the thing. I'm not a trophy hunter like I said in the question and answer video. If I can get some trophies just playing the campaign and whatnot, just playing online, cool, not an issue. But if I somehow manage to get really close to a platinum trophy, you know, just playing the game and shit like that, I'll go for it. And with most wanted, I'm pretty damn close to getting the platinum trophy. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe I need three of the online trophies or some bullshit like that. I know I have to play with friends in a speed. So as soon as we start this motherfucker, that's one trophy. I know I have to knock one of you assholes out so I get another trophy. <laughs> Hey, look, it's all part of the game, man. We're gonna be knocking the shit out of each other. So I need to knock one motherfucker out to get another trophy in that bitch. The final thing that I need to do is unlock some of the pro mods online and shit like that. You know, for the cars, they have like, you know, like perks, like Call of Duty and shit like that. So obviously, online, they have these things, pro mods or whatever. So I have to do some of those bullshits for one fucking car. So doing that with friends is gonna be so much easier than having to play with the randoms online and shit. You drop out of rooms all the time and leave and quit and all. Fuck all that bullshit, man. You know, I was able to do all the campaign type trophies and regular races, but I'm literally down to these last screens. Anybody that played this game online knows that this shit is horrible. <laughs> the fuck, Criterion, man? I mean, did you guys try this shit out before you rolled it out? I mean, like, really? Drifting around a lighthouse? I mean, that makes some perfect sense to you? Standing perfectly fucking still on a platform for the longest time possible? I mean, come on, man. Does that sound fucking fun? What the fuck, man? You bunch of assholes couldn't figure this shit out. This wasn't fun. Whatever, man. I'm not going to tear Criterion new asshole over this bullshit, but the easiest way to get into this open lobby is to visit the link in the description and sign up. You know, I'm going to make some rooms on my friend list and whatnot and try and get as many people as I can as possible. Now, remember this shit. The limit is seven people in a room. All we can get is eight people online. So if I get a response of, like, 30 fucking people, all I can take is seven people. Unfortunately, Need for Speed lobbies aren't like college frat houses or Kim Kardashian's vagina where you can try and fit as many people as possible. <laughs> seven is the limit that I can have in this bitch. But anyway, I'll be recording the motherfucker and of course, I might cherry pick only the good videos where I did well. <laughs> Fuck that, man. If I finish the last place, y'all ain't gonna see that bullshit, man. So anyway, go sign up. Y'all get into the room, can hear me scream and rage and all that bullshit because obviously I say it all the time, I have some real rage up in this motherfucker. But anyway, as always, rate, comment, subscribe, and all that good shit. Like I said, guys, go check out the link in the description, go sign up, and we'll have a party Saturday up in this bitch.